and happy Vlogmas Day 16. So to start my day, I'm going to fill out my daily planner. I'm going to make a to-do list and fill out things that I need to do throughout the day. And it, it'll just make it easier to complete my tasks, make sure I get everything done, because a lot of the times I forget that I have to do certain things. So today I have iced coffee because it's not super cold today. I'm not even wearing a sweater. And I slept with my fans on last night. Like some nights it's colder and some nights it's not so cold. It's just a crazy December. Okay, so the things that I have on my to-do list for today are laundry, clean up room, take out trash, fold clean laundry, wash dishes, pick up checks, pack for Jordans and crochet. The things at the top of my list are things that I absolutely have to get done today. By the end of the day, I'll write down in the I'll get to that tomorrow section. I'll write in what I have to do tomorrow. So in this daily planner, they have a morning section, afternoon section, evening section. I'll get to that tomorrow and notes. So like I said, by the end of the day today, I'll write in what I have to do tomorrow. For morning, afternoon, and evening, I guess you can kind of like assign little tasks to each part of the day. I'm gonna leave the evening section open for right now just because I'm not completely sure what that is going to entail. But I think I'm pretty much done with my daily planner all set to go. And then I'll just leave my red pen here so I can cross everything off as I complete it. So let's get the day started, shall we? Look how many oranges we're getting. Oh my gosh. Anybody want some oranges? <laughs> Alright guys, so I just got my laundry out of the dryer. It's a small load and I also have that laundry over there. So I'm going to fold all of it and watch some friends and I'll catch up with you guys in a little bit. Hey guys, I am about to pack for my boyfriend's house. I'm planning on going tomorrow and I just want to have everything packed and ready to go so I don't have to worry about it. And I went on Instagram and YouTube. And I was just asking everybody to send me in some questions so I can answer them in my Vlogmas video. And only a couple people sent in questions. So I'm going to read them. I was like, might as well, you know, answer some questions while I'm vlogging. I thought it would be fun. First, I'm going to show you guys my bags that I use. This is a, this is called an overnight bag, but I just call it a duffel bag. And it looks like this. It's Minnie Mouse and it's so cute. So I got it from this little website that actually my boyfriend's mom introduced me to. Hi, Mama Julie. And I love it. Um, I love this bag because you can 
make it a little bit smaller with the snap button. And you can make it bigger by unbuttoning it. I usually keep it unbuttoned just so I can fit more things in it. But I really love that. And then I got a matching tote bag. And I love this one too. It's super cute. And I use this to carry like my makeup and so toiletries and any extra things that I need to take. And then I'll use the duffel bag for my clothes and my shoes and all of that fun stuff. Three questions. My girl Emma Kate here on YouTube, she asked, do you have any holiday traditions? The only holiday traditions that we have are like going to look at Christmas lights. Um, when I go with my parents and my younger sister, we'll usually go get Starbucks. And then we go to Meadow Lane here in Stockton. We did that earlier this month, so you will see that in Vlogmas. I don't remember what day, but we actually went with my sister and her husband and their baby. And it was my nephew's first time looking at Christmas lights. It was so cute. And it was the first time we actually walked around. We usually just drive around. Um, and it was really fun. We didn't get Starbucks though. That was the only thing we didn't do this year. Other than that, I don't think we have any other holiday traditions. I guess like our, just what we do on Christmas Eve and Christmas Day has been a tradition every year. Um, we have a Christmas Eve dinner and um, my sisters come over and we all open our gifts Christmas Eve. And then Christmas Day, my parents host Christmas every year. So I think that's about it. That's pretty much all we do. Nicole Amber asked me a question. Hey, Nicole. She asked me, what does your ideal five-year plan look like? Hmm. Okay. Right now, I am 22. And I've been with my boyfriend now for almost 11 months. Christmas Day actually will be 11 months. And I am pretty set in my career. You know, I'm a hairdresser. With that being said, I think within the next five years, I hope to be married to my boyfriend. Let's see, I'll be 27 in five years and he'll be 29. That's crazy. I definitely want to buy a house, get married, maybe have one kid. I'm not really sure. Um, I do know that I want to enjoy married life and you know, before we get into having babies and just enjoy life. I think that's pretty much it. Let's see who else sent me a question. Oh, my boyfriend, Jordan, says, how is it possible to be that beautiful? Your boyfriend, one lucky guy. No, I'm the lucky one. Let's be honest. My sister actually sent me a question. She sent me a couple questions, actually. How she said, is going for what you do you like you about working for the Christmas season? season? You should post more than life videos. I love everything about working in the salon. It's great. I mean, I'm surrounded by amazing people and I am learning new things every day. And I love that I can make my own schedule. I'm my own boss. And I love that I just get to make people feel better about themselves. Um, you know, doing their hair and yeah. And you should post more than life videos. You know, I I want to post more beauty videos again, but it just, it's hard anymore just to sit down and do my makeup because I don't really do my makeup anymore all that much. Like, I really don't. Vlogmas is going great so far. I am enjoying every minute of it, and I'm very excited for the Christmas season. I'm not doing as many Christmassy things that I would have liked to do. She asked me another question. Um, what is your favorite thing about crocheting? What is your favorite item that you crocheted? And what is your favorite color that you've crocheted so far? Hmm. Just realized that I have not been packing at all while answering these questions. My favorite thing about crocheting is that it's very therapeutic. It's very relaxing for me to just sit down and make something. Like, that is just so cool to me. Um... Yeah, it's very relaxing, but just the thought that I can turn yarn, just a skein of yarn, into a beanie, or a scarf, or a shawl, or a blanket. Like, it's crazy. There are so many things that you can make. My favorite item that I've crocheted so far is probably beanies. Um, I've been making a lot of beanies, and I think that is something that's really cool to um, have and to say that I 
hand crocheted this and didn't buy this from the store, that's awesome to me. This is probably my favorite color that I've used so far. I think it's really pretty. I am going to finish packing here and I'll catch up with you guys in a little bit. All right, you guys, I'm gonna end the vlog here. I pretty much completed almost everything on my to-do list today and I do have some things that I need to complete tomorrow, which is okay. I was kind of expecting that, but I am all packed and ready to go to my boyfriend's house tomorrow. And I have just been crocheting like crazy. I got one whole gift done today and I'm so excited. I hope you guys enjoyed today's vlog and I will see you guys in tomorrow's Vlogmas Day 17.